Countdown to the caucuses. We are four days from the election shaping contest in Iowa. And I know that sounds like just a lot of political jargon, but it's important. It will set the tone for the rest of the crucial 2020 election. And lots of folks from the Chicago area are playing a key role in this. CBS 2's Tim McNicholas headed west to the Hawkeye State to see for himself. 180 miles from the rolling hills of Iowa. Anthony Casada loads up a car in Logan Square. Where should I put this? He's a Chicago guy, but on weekends he volunteers in Des Moines, Clinton, and Cedar Rapids, going door to door for his candidate. We're kind of like a strike team. Uh, we've been hitting, you know, places where the campaign needs a lot of help. You know, we're Spanish-speaking individuals, so we're going to places where they need that kind of assistance. Volunteers aren't just taking their personal cars. Some campaigns are sending buses from Chicago to Iowa. Once the bus crosses this bridge over the Mississippi River, the volunteers know they are in the Hawkeye State, and it's game time. But if you want to grab a seat upstairs, Dylan Sharkey doesn't need a bus or car. He's already there. A University of Iowa student from St. Charles. And this is really the first step in the election. Volunteers like Sharkey and Quesada aren't asking people to punch a private ballot. In the Iowa caucuses, people visibly show their support by standing in a group or even raising their hands, often under signage for their candidate. In other words, you are announcing your preference to your neighbors at an event filled with debate that could take hours. A foreign concept to a guy from the Chicago Burbs. And they literally just count people at a table or in a corner, and that's how they mark you down. Sharkey says Iowa is also key because it sets the tone. You guys want to go upstairs, listen to Joe Biden? And when his candidate took the stage in Iowa City. Folks, every four years, democracy begins here in Iowa, and it really does. Sharkey found a seat right behind him, along with Ethan Cox, a Northwestern student who is spending most of his week volunteering in Iowa. This is what is important to me. This is what I want to do. This is, um, again, this is the election of my lifetime. We also caught up with other volunteers for other campaigns, and just about everyone agrees February 3rd might be the most important date right now. Tim McNicholas, CBS 2 News. Tomorrow at 6 a.m., Tim explains the question puzzling many who don't live in Iowa. What the heck is a caucus?